Hello everyone, this is Christian Green from Nature Hails Us and right now I'm currently inside Whole Food. I'm inside the water, uh, the water section and I want to show you guys all of these alkaline spring water brands that people buy assuming that they're getting healthy and that these water is actually benefiting them. So what the purpose of this video is to basically show you what's inside the water, the mineral continent. So let's take a look real quick okay so right now what we have here okay we have Poland Spring everyone knows Poland Spring we have Smart Water um, we have Volvic Natural Spring Water Eternal Iceland Iceland okay Fiji Essentia and we have Flow Water now what's the problem with these water these water looks great and they have a nice look to it but there's one major problem and that one major problem is the fact that that the minerals that are inside those water are inorganic inorganic basically means dead uh, they're not alive they don't contain carbon and carbon is the basis of this the basis of all life if I pick any water right now if I pick any water what you want to do is when you buy water you want to go into the supermarket look at the ingredients look at look at what mineral is inside that water and you need to ask yourself is this mineral alive or is this mineral dead that is what you want to do so right now I got Fiji Fiji's a popular name brand so I'm looking at Fiji right now okay and the mineral that's inside this water is silica calcium and magnesium those are great we need that it's a part of our biological structure the question is the question is are these mineral inorganic or are these mineral minerals minerals that we can uh, we could uh, digest our body can use the mineral inside this water is inorganic because because the plant didn't convert these minerals these inorganic minerals into minerals so off the back this water is not good period um, let's get another one let's get a Evian so what's the mineral continent in the back so the mineral continent in the back it has calcium magnesium potassium silica great those are great but they're not doing any good for your body because the mineral is inorganic it's inorganic that's why uh, what, another brand another brand so I'm looking at flow water right now flow water contains it contains calcium blah 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 blah, blah. so it only contains calcium like I said is it alive or is it dead the mineral is dead it's inorganic so here's the thing that you need to comprehend about about these spring waters none of them is good the only water you should consume is distilled water and the reason to that is because when we talk about minerals we need to we need to talk about where, the, where, do, the, where do where do these minerals come from these minerals come from the ground it comes from the ground and how do these minerals get converted into how does these inorganic minerals get converted into minerals you need to understand that the plant does this process with the help of photosynthesis the plant releases humic humic and vulvic acid into the roots once it releases that substance it then convert the inorganic minerals into minerals now these minerals are bioavailable they are bioavailable so the, so you need to understand that the plant has to release what is called humic humic and vulvic acid into the root once that process is done it converts these inorganic minerals into minerals and now our cells can assimilate them that's the reason that's the whole purpose of having the roots in the ground is to pick up these minerals inorganic minerals and convert them into minerals water does not have that functionality it doesn't have that capability of turning something that is dead into something that is alive and when these minerals get converted into uh, when these inorganic minerals get converted into minerals now they contain carbon the basis of life so 
what? distilled water is the only water for consumption. It's the ideal water that you want to consume. If you want minerals, if you want minerals, you get it from your plants, okay? Get it from a plant-based supplement, or you get it from your herbs. If you need minerals, like I said, a plant-based supplement, get them from your herbs, or, or uh, get them from the fruits and vegetables, okay? And another thing about these, uh, about, the, about the inorganic minerals compared to minerals is that the electrons. What's wrong with the, the electrons is that when it comes to inorganic minerals, their electron spins anti-clockwise. They're spinning out of, out of synchronization with our cells. They're not in harmony with our cells. And the electrons found in, or in minerals, the ones that we could assume, uh, consume, those uh, electrons spin clockwise with our cells so they're spinning in harmony yeah. with our cells okay. so the minerals so the, the the in the inorganic minerals that are found in all of these main brand spring water are dead they don't contain carbon which is the basis of life their electron spins anti-clockwise their electron spins anti-clockwise which doesn't work well with our cells we need something that corresponds with our cell okay so yeah, so thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, look up distilled water research. This, distilled water is the only water you want to drink. Um, when it comes to Dr. Sebi, uh, Dr. Sebi doesn't know everything. I respect Dr. Sebi. I love that guy. But you need to understand that when it comes to the minerals, the minerals that are found in these water, our body can't assimilate these minerals. I mean, Dr. Sebi's telling you to drink spring water, but he's not telling you about the minerals. Are they dead or are they alive? You could, you could ask any biochemist about inorganic minerals versus minerals. Um, if you like this video, please like this video, subscribe, share, follow me on Instagram, Chris underscore the underscore healer.